the Lily Kiln is self-contained and can be placed on any countertop or tabletop for firing. However, there must be a minimum of clearance of 12 inches on each side of the kiln and a minimum of 36 inches of clearance on the top of the kiln. When you turn on the power button, you will hear a beep and after a few moments, you will see the display say idle as well as show you the temperature on the inside chamber of the kiln. There are several preset programs for the Lily Kiln and I'm going to show you how to use them. Press the start stop key and you will see the display say program. To scroll through the several different programs, press the higher key to scroll through the programs until you get to the desired program for your firing. To see and review each of the program settings, press the lower key and it will run through and review the program settings. I'm going to press the lower key and it will show me the delay, ramp, firing temperature, and hold time for that particular program. Then the display will say start. If that is the desired program that I want for my firing, I simply press the start stop key and the display will say on. The kiln will now start to fire. Now I'm going to press the start stop button again and get back to where the display says idle. The Lily Kiln also has a manual firing program. That is program number six. So I'm going to press the start stop button and right now it says program five. So I'm going to press the higher key until it says program six. Now I want to manually set each of the settings on the kiln. So I'm going to press the start stop button and it will say ramp. Right now it is at full speed. If I want to change that I will press the higher and lower keys until I reach the desired ramp speed for my firing. Press the stop start button again and it will show the temperature in Fahrenheit. Right now the kiln is set to fire to 1646 degrees. I will use the higher and lower keys until I get to the desired temperature for my firing. Press the start stop key again and it will say hold. Right now the program is set for five minutes. I will use the higher and lower keys until I get the desired number of minutes. Press the start stop key again and it will say ramp 2. Right now it is flashing zero. Ramp 2 is an additional program that you can use, but if you don't need it, leave it at zero. Press start stop again and it will say start. Now I am ready to fire at my manual program. Press start stop and the kiln will say on and it will automatically begin firing. I'm going to press start stop again to stop the kiln and get back to where it says idle. Now I'm going to show you how to use the Liliolo firing program. That is program one. I'm going to press the start stop key to display program and I'm going to press the higher key until I get to program one. Press start stop and the kiln will say start. Press start stop again and the kiln will say on. Once it starts firing, it will show you the temperature of the kiln chamber as it goes up to reach its firing temperature. With all the programs, when the kiln is done firing, it will automatically shut itself off and beep for 60 seconds.